These are the five must have t-shirt niches in 2024. My goal with this video is to help you find low competition t-shirt design niches and give you an idea of what's selling because you may be stuck in a little rut and you're having some issues with research and this is why I'm here to help you. And if you're new to my channel, my name is RJ Martinez. I learn to do thousands and thousands of dollars each month with print on demand and I do this full time. Check out this cool screenshot right here of my Amazon Merch On Demand account. With that being said, let's get into the content. Everything that I found inside of this video, I use Merch Informer, okay? One of my favorite tools inside of here is Movers and Shakers. So if you come over here to the left-hand column, product research, come over here to Movers and Shakers. You click on Movers and Shakers, it's gonna pull like a ton of different niches from amazon.com and look at this one i need a huge cocktail that's funny i think this is a really cool design simple text based but you can see exactly what they did here and then it's just showing you different like so many different cupid's favorite cheerleader there's a ton of different niches right here but it's the thing is pulling like the top selling designs in a, in a niche and you can filter it up here too a little bit if you want instead of daily you can do weekly monthly or you can do like different types of products over here in the different marketplaces but let's say this 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 t-shirt for example if I come over and click over this, this goes directly over to amazon.com, one of the best online shopping platforms or the best, the number one shopping on online platform, right? So this is where I, I enjoy do, doing a lot of my research or you can even do research on Etsy too. Etsy is a good spot too, but like something like this, this is just a, a funny humor design, right? Like you, you can, you can do, there's a, there's a lot of stuff like this on Amazon that's selling on Etsy, Redbubble. It just, it's a, it's a really good, you know, idea to do research over here and you can see like, you know, like cer certain designs that are not selling, but then all of a sudden they start to crank and they start to make sales and start making sales consistently every month you can find them over here by using this this tactic that i'm showing you right here so a really awesome way to do research and you can just even just use this and just come in here and just see like what's going on what new niches what new ideas you can possibly find inside of here so i highly recommend you use this tool my link's going to be down below in the description for this check it out all right, so the first niche is I survived my mom's nursing degree. And one thing too I want to touch on is making sure that you double check everything for trademarks and all that fun stuff. You do not want to create something that I'm sharing with you in here or in a niche that you're, I'm sharing with you in here and then it's trademark or copyright. So make sure that you learn that, double check that. This is something that I've personally been doing for the last seven years and I always double check everything when it comes to any of this stuff. So it's very important that you understand that. Now, this right here, nursing degree, school so nursing degree de nursing degree school or degree nursing school or nursing school however you want to say it, graduation this is basically i survived so it's like a, like the kid or you know the, the daughter or the son or or, or or the little kid or in the family is going to be wearing this shirt i survived my mom's nursing degree survive my mom's nursing degree it's a cool funny shirt i think it's a really awesome shirt plain plain all white text nothing too crazy this something like this can be created like in 10 to 20, 30 seconds, right? But the point is it's a funny, like humorous, like funny shirt, right? It, it, it's, it's, it's really cool. I think it's a, it's a really cool design and it's simple. But the thing is, it's like when it's graduation time, this is gonna be a design that's gonna be trending all year long. So if we come down, you can see all the colors, all the darker colors, 1395, it's like real low price point, but let's look at the all time sales. You can see that it's a consistent seller, but then when it comes getting closer to May, it seems like it's trending down a lot and it's doing it again. So like at like the beginning of April, May, I think this is a really good design. And then in Q4, it starts to make sales, but it makes sales throughout the whole year. But when it comes to April and then Q4, it seems like it's making more sales, right? Which is really cool. Look at it, it's making more sales. So really cool design. And then let's come over here. Let's look at the results. We have a result of 484. I survived my mom's nursing degree t-shirt. And next thing I'm thinking about just other what can what else can you do with this there's so much that can be done with this literally just take this saying and 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 scale it out into different niches so if you have a top selling t-shirt design in a niche can you apply this to that niche that you're in okay so think about it that way i always say that because it's the easiest thing to do if you have a top selling design on your amazon merch account your etsy account your redbubble account if you can take a phrase and then apply it to your account or you, to your niche, it's it's a good idea. Next niche is going to be how planes fly and then funny aerospace engineer, engineering. You see what they're doing here. They're kind of just breaking down like a diagram of an airplane, right? So how planes fly, magic air, magic air, air, very important magic, some more magic. It's like a, it's like a funny humorous like design, like a diagram of a, of a plane and just, you know, breaking it all down, which is like a playful, play on a design which is really cool and then the color too it like it goes really well on the t-shirt you know that 
the blue and then there's just the white outlining of an airplane right it's pretty cool i like it it's a real cool design you can see that it has 103 ratings so obviously it's doing something right and one thing to always recommend if you see the ratings or you see the reviews and it has a ton of like good information down there those are actual customers that are paying for that product and buying it so you can get an idea of who they are purchasing it for okay always look at those reviews those reviews are going to tell you a story and give you a ton of good information 1695 price point come down here let's look at the all-time sales whoa it's cranking look <laughs> dang like like this right here as a print on demand seller you want to see stuff like this because the thing is crank it's off the chain it's going off the chain on this one right here but look at that dang so the bsr is like 85k but just there's a little dip right here like in look at q4 like cr closer to christmas there's a dip and there's another dip right there but it's just consistent throughout the whole month of every single month. Like this right here, this design has probably made over $10,000 since being alive on Amazon, it looks like, right? First first sell in 2018, but just continuously selling. That's 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 what we, you know, that's what you look for. And then if you come over here, we're gonna come over here and look at the results of 424 result, how planes fly aerospace t-shirt. And then if we come down, just think of in this niche, in general there is another 73k bsr there's a there's a lot of basically i'm saying there's demand in this niche if you create something inside this niche and i'm not sharing you this design so you can copy this one but look at these other ones like the goal is to show you niches that have a demand and if you see something like where the next design is at a 73k bsr and then if you look at that bsr chart on this one that is consistently that consistently selling that means there's demand when you see stuff like this sales velocity there's a demand there's people purchasing in this space or in this niche all right, with that being said, next design, aggressive cuddling, funny, vintage BB, no, BJJ, Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu. This is a cool, that's a cool t-shirt, right? I uh, got that retro style going on, aggressive cuddling. So just, you know, Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, if you're unaware of that, look it up. You know, obviously there's a lot of like different techniques, different styles going on. And, and I like what they did, aggressive cuddling. Pretty cool, pretty funny, little flip on it. And if you know, you know, you know, what, you know what they're trying to say. If you don't understand this niche, you know exactly what they're trying to say here. Pretty cool. I like it. Funny. And then if you look at the all-time sales, look at all-time sales, you're going to see that it's made its first sale in 2022. And then going into the new year of 2023, it's continuously selling. And then in Q4 this year, it is starting to make more sales and starting to rank into the algorithm and it's starting to get reviewed. Now, if we come over here, aggressive cuddling t-shirt, we have a result of 479. Next niche, a sloth does more work than my pancreas type one diabetes t-shirt. So it's a light colored, well, it's on a light colored t-shirt, right? And this is something that I always say, if it, it's most likely going to sell on a black color t-shirt. Most likely it has a good chance of selling on a lighter color t-shirt. So if you can make the design look good on a black t-shirt, try to make the design look good on a white t-shirt. Okay. That's one way to cover a niche. And especially if you have a top seller, man, like do you have to do that. If you're not doing that or you're just thinking about it, get it done. Hurry up and get it done because that's one way you, you're just going to cover the niche and make more sales. And you can literally go from making $50 a month with that one t-shirt design to $100 a month, right? And that's a big difference because then if you do that over and over, it, it, the sales are going to add up pretty quickly. You know, you got the sloth that looks like it's hanging from a tree, right? And then it has the, I think this is the ribbon, this is the, like the diabetes awareness ribbon also too making sure that you double checking colors and stuff like that that's very important when you're creating these designs but it's a it's like a it's a playful design but it like it has like this it's like a it's a serious design too if that makes sense like a balance of both because i can see it you know being playful but then obviously making a statement when being serious about you know the the the, the type 1 diabetes right so as you can see right here 15 ratings 4.9 out of 5 to come down look at the all-time sales bsr and yeah look at that's cool it has a consistent selling t-shirt right as you can see it where every time it goes up so it goes up and then it makes a sell it drops down that means it made a sell it goes up drops down again so when it goes up down up down it's basically it's making sales into the amazon algorithm it's the bsr bestseller rank and then if we come over here we look at the result a sloth does more work than my pancreas t-shirt we got a result of 504 so i want to say like once you start to make sales if you go down let's go down the middle of this page probably it's like some pancreas there's so obviously look at this see so this is one thing i'm like i'm talking about like when you when you see this type of stuff when you see like you know there's a ton of like competition over here like with the same design they're using them just flipping the you know the sloth and making turning into something different and trying to you know create a different design think of like what other animals like maybe you're not you don't want you're not sloth you can do like a different type of animal when it comes to this niche and that's one way to actually 
dive into something like that and create a top seller in a different niche or just in your niche in general, you can do that too. I have next niche. I have gone zero days without making a dad joke. Now this one right here is like, you know, for the fathers out there, you know, that enjoy making those dad jokes, 63 rating, more of like that square type of design. And it has that, you know, like the, the faded effects on the actual design itself. I have gone zero days without making a dad joke. My previous record was zero days, 63 ratings, 1698. Come down here, $16.98. And then if we come over here, look at it made its first sell in 2021. And then it started, you know, trending. And when dad jokes came more and more popular, you can see like, you know, it started making sales. And then in 2022 it went down lower and then it's consistently making sales. So like, obviously the bigger picture, the bigger niche is dad jokes. So just funny stuff, dad jokes, certain things, even dad jokes on t-shirts work good. Even, you know, just like stuff like this, like these type of designs like that work really good. And then if we come over here, we have a result of 618. I have gone zero days without making a dad joke t-shirt and I keep all my dad jokes in a dad a base. <laughs> like for here's another example. You see that one right there, 84, 84 KBSR, uh, 147 KBSR. Look at like this whole, these four designs, right? These are, these are sponsored ads, right? But if you look at them, there is a demand for those three t-shirt designs because look at the, the BSR on that one. And then the number one ranking for that actual saying is this one right here, 172 KBSR without ads. It's probably, maybe, maybe might be running ads. I don't know. If I do a little bit more research, I can obviously find that. But just with that right there, ranking number one with no ads, it's obviously saying something. There's a demand for this niche or the, just that design in general. And if you enjoy this type of niche research, check out this video right here. I have more low competition niches for you. If you have any questions, feel free to comment down below. Give this video a thumbs up. Thank you very much for watching.